Ready? There's red, red, yellow, yellow, orange, orange, blue, blue, green, green, purple, purple. We don't need books, sweetheart. Read that one afterwards. Pink. 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 Who's this? Look at mommy. Look at mommy. Pink. <laughs> Brown. The color and like your last name. A black and white. You want to see the colors? That's woody color. Pink. Ooh. Mama loves pink too. It's pink. I like pink. I like pink and I like aqua. See? We're gonna brush your teeth. Like Bubba. Bushy, 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 bushy. Bushy, 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 bushy. <gasps> Blue. Ready? Ready? Blue. Ready? Blue. Blue. Blue character. You brush your teeth. Nom, nom, nom. Oh, go boom, boom. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, shoot. How do you pull it back in, though? Mm, so you just put that in there. That's kind of cool. See? Yellow. Ooh. Yellow. Blue. Yellow. Oh, there's cookie. Runny. Cookie. Nom, 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 nom. I'll show you right now, Bubba, okay? <gasps> Brush your teeth. Brush your teeth. Pink. Purple. Green. Blue. Orange. Yellow. Yellow, 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 yellow. Red. Like yellow? It looks very pretty. This is a really good book. I'm going to take care of this one for you. It's cookie. Cookie have. Nom, 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 nom. Nom, 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 yeah, up, down, water. Ready to brush his teeth? See, she brushes her teeth. Ready? Nom, 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 nom. Ready? Brush his teeth. Your turn. Get it. Nom, nom, nom. Oh, okay, and everybody says, good job, Randy. What do you want me? <laughs> this is a really good one, Bubba. I gotta get this one up here. I don't want to get boom boom.
Little Hoaisa was very small Indian brave. One night he saw something that made his eyes go big. The old braves were dancing around the campfire and they were chanting a strange song. Little Little Heist ran into his father's teepee. There sat his father, Big Chief, and his sister, Sunflower. Father cried, Little Haitha, why are the braves dancing tonight? They are dancing a fish dance, said Big Chief. Tomorrow there will be a fishing contest, he went on. The brave who catches the biggest fish will get to wear my war belt and be a chief for a day. Little, little Hai smiled proudly. I will catch the biggest fish, he said. I will win the contest. You are too small to catch a big fish, said Sunflower. I will help you. Little Hai scowled. Sisters are a lot of trouble, he said. I don't need your help. Sunflower just smiled. Maybe she would help and maybe not. Little Hai stamped, stamped out of his father's teepee. Sunflower thinks I am too little to do something big, he said. I will show her. That night, Little Hai dreamed that he caught a huge fish. In his dream, he caught he got to where the chiefs wore bonded for one whole day. Early the next morning, Little High went to the lake where he kept his canoe. He was carrying his fishing pole. <laughs> Early the next morning, Little High went to the lake where he kept his canoe. He was carrying his fishing pole. Little High paddled his canoe out onto the lake. Oh, when I am chief for a day, he thought I will make sunflower work. As he paddled along, many fish leaped out of the water, but they were all too small. Little High was looking for a really huge fish. Big fish. We'll go fishing. Huge. Huge, huge fish. Don't need me so Suddenly, he heard a loud splash, and there it was, the biggest fish he had ever seen. Little High picked up his pole, and now it looked very small. The fishing pole was not strong enough to, for such a huge fish. Then he had an idea. He grabbed his rope and made a loop at one end. He tossed it over the big fish. Swoosh. The fish slipped through. So Little High tried again. This time he swung his rope high. This time he swung his rope to the right. And this time he remembered to pull tight. As if he caught the fish by the tail. The fish tried to swim away. Little High hung on to the rope. He went very fast. But uh, Ruthie. But uh, at last the fish was too tired to swim anymore. Little High tried the rope to his canoe and paddled to the shore. He tied the other end of the rope to a tree and then he ran home to get a net. Sunflower was going to the lake to wash a basket of clothes. Hi brother, she said happily. to get a net. Sunflower was going to the lake to wash a basket of clothes. Hi, brother, she said happily, but little High did not stop. He was running too fast. Sunflower walked on toward the lake. Little High is acting very silly. Brothers are a lot of trouble. Down at the lake, there was another kind of trouble. The fish was trying to get loose. Sunflower dumped the clothes on a rock and sat her basket on the shore. Just then, the fish made one last leap and it landed in Sunflower's basket and Sunflower was su surprised. Why the fish is tied up beside my brother's canoe, she said. It must be his. I will take it to him. She covered the fish with a blanket so it could not jump out of the basket. As Sunflower was walking home, Little High ran by his net. Come on and see. I am helping you, she called. Don't bother me. Cried Little High. I am busy. Sunflower was angry. She looked at the fish. I'll teach the brother mother of mine a lesson she said she took a basket to the big chief here is a fish for the contest she said when little high reached the lake he picked up the rope the fish got away he said sadly excuse, excuse me ma'am
Out he went to fish again, but at the end of the day, he had only one small fish to take home. As he came into camp, Little High heard the news. The winner of the fishing contest was Sunflower, his sister. Sunflower got to wear the war bonnet. Look at the big fish your sister caught, said the two. That's nothing for Little High. I caught one much bigger, but it got away. The next morning, Sunflower became chief for the day. As chief, I will put you to work. She told her, I'll wash the clothes. Little High tugged off with the clothes back. It was terrible. thought my sister gets to tell me what to do. When he came back, Sunflower told him the whole story. That's the chief, this is the one you caught, she said. She told Big Chief, too. I want to see what the war bonnet is on his head. How do you think, she said? I hope you will be next to me. Little High just smiled. Maybe he's going to be next to me. Maybe not. <laughs> Yes, sweetheart. Come on, baby. You're going to get cock all over.